Hey guys, today we're going to talk about breaking in your shoes the professional way. Let's see. We have this tool that good cobblers have and this is used for uh, breaking in shoes without hurting your feet. Let's see. We have this lotter shoe and we want to break in our Forza for us without hassle. And back. So we got the shoe in the tool and what we're gonna do now is position the length marker here. Okay, just a bit further here right now so I'm getting it further in the toe box now this is in the position that I want now with this part I will widen the shoe from both sides you can see the shoe is expanding and breaking in Okay, so this is the amount I need, but if I take this out immediately, this will not have any good effect. So, the suggested period is about 2 to 5 hours, and if it's leather, like this shoe, real leather, um, it will have more permanent effects. If it's synthetic, you might want to do this like every other day, and some of the points you should consider is that the glue on the shoe should not be um, near the place that you're widening the shoe otherwise the glue will come out and your shoe will be useless and another thing is that if you widen a leather shoe too much you might not be able to revert it back to the original position that's that also some shoes especially this shoe if you don't untie it first, you might tear apart the lacing system. With the lacing system is located here. And if you put too much pressure on the lacing system, it will tear apart and your shoe will be damaged again. So yeah, this is a professional cobbler tool and it should be used professionally. Professional football players have these many of them something similar to these or just this type and yeah if you want to speed up the process or make the leather shoe uh, soft at the same time you might want to apply leather food or olive oil as well